Okay, Miss Amanda from America. We want to ask you how is uh, how you feel about after the Vizian implantable contact lens. It's been wonderful. The day after, I've been able to see perfectly and very little discomfort. Well, how about uh, the night vision that you? How how was your night vision before and after? Before my night vision was really bad. Um, I would just see lots of halos, and all the cars kind of looked like one long car. I couldn't see anything, and now I can see everything perfectly outside at night. Were you able to drive at night in the United States before the implants? Not safely, no, but I would do it. How how would you do now? I think I would drive pretty well. Okay, and uh, now did you read the paper today or did you test your vision today? Did you take your vision for a test drive? <laughs> I, I went to the mall and I went shopping. And were you able to see everything that you liked to shop before? Perfect. <laughs> now you, you uh, told us about that the contacts would, would start, you know, get your eye uh, fatigued and tired and well, how, describe that to us. With contacts, they would get dirty, and by the end of the day, my eyes just felt very tired and sore, and I haven't felt that today. Wonderful. And your vision has been sharp. Very sharp. And this is going to be your vision for the next 100 years. Yes. Okay. Well, Dr. Honey, would you please tell us about this uh, implantable contact lenses, please? The implantable contact lens is the option for patients who are not good candidates for other procedures like the LASIK or the intralasic or the ultralasic. Patients with thin cornea or patients with uh, suspect uh, cases of keratoconus for example, uh, those patients they would benefit a lot from uh, this technology which is the implantable contact lens from Vizian. Uh, also, it works very well in patients with very high refractive errors like extreme myopia, like more than minus 12, for example. Uh, in those patients, we cannot correct their refractive error with LASIK. So we have to use this technique. And this technique is an outpatient procedure. We do it under topical anesthesia, exactly like the LASIK. And Amanda was fantastic. She did very well. She was so cooperative and we uh, did her two eyes in just less than 20 minutes and she was seeing 2020 one hour after the procedure. Okay. Well, so, Amanda, l let me ask Amanda, how was your surgical experience? Well, I was really, really, really nervous, but Dr. Hanny made me feel um, comfortable and safe about it. Okay. And how was your, were you awake during the surgery? awake and uh, you were asked questions and and you were cooperative mm -hmm. and uh, immediately was the surgery painful at all or discomfort no it was just the only thing I didn't like was having to stay still and having there is a bright light you have to look at yeah but other than that but I felt no pain no anything okay and it lasted like he told you about 10 minutes each eye mm -hmm. that's fantastic would you recommend the surgery for everyone? I would definitely recommend the surgery. How strongly would you recommend it? Beyond 100%. <laughs> okay, Dr. Haney. Do you have, uh, what was the reason Amanda needed this surgery? Amanda needed the surgery because her corneal thickness is about 400 microns. So uh, she's not a good candidate for LASIK because we cannot leave a cornea thinner than 400 microns after LASIK. So already she uh, has a cornea of 400 microns. So LASIK is contraindicated in her case. Also she has a steep cornea. Her corneal power is 46 diopter. 46 diopter, this means that even with a little bit thicker cornea, it would be risky to do LASIK for her. But fortunately, uh, her topography was very normal. It is safe for her to do any procedure. It is going to last because her cornea it is not at risk from developing any changes in the future. So the results uh, that she achieved now, she's going to keep for 
hopefully the rest of our life. Fantastic. Now, Amanda, let's take a close-up at your eyes. And... It's not even red the next day after surgery. <laughs> right? Mm -hmm. And you're happy with your new vision? Now, Very what happy. was the new vision that you measured yesterday with these new lenses? 2010. Is, what, is this better than 2020? Uh-huh. 2020 and then 2010 is even better than... 2010 is better than 2020, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, check it down. Okay. Well, thank you. And you would come again from the United States to have Dr. Hanny recheck you, right? <laughs> yes. Okay. Thank you, Miss Amanda.